For much of the school year, students at Council Bluffs Public Schools have walked by these kits, hoping to never have to use them. Tourniquet kits, designed to stop bleeding during traumatic events. If you would have asked me 15 or 20 years ago, I probably wouldn't even thought that we would have something like this in the schools, but the idea that we do is really good in case we, in case we need them. Tim Hamilton with the school district says it was Pottawatomie County Emergency Management that spearheaded the effort, getting grant money to put these kits, which cost around $900 a piece, in every school in the county. Some students are already fully trained. That includes this advanced health science class. Senior Peyton Bernhard says in an emergency, you can use a scarf or tie as a tourniquet, but the kits just work better. Rather than just using something that could have germs or any like bacteria or anything on it, this is clean and then you're going to be packing it with something that's clean. At least one of these kits is located in every school in the district and inside of it includes instructions. So in the event of an emergency, anybody inside the school can help out. Even if you aren't specifically trained in Stop the Bleed, um, you, could, you could figure out how to use it. It's a pretty simple process. The district plan is to slowly fully train staff how to use them before eventually teaching the high school students. Bernhards, a future nursing student, says her best advice for those learning is to stay focused so they can save a life. Being able to effectively communicate and get it done and make sure that you're doing it all correctly, not skipping a step, things like that. In Council Bluffs, John Kipper, 3 News Now.